That's going to be driving you guys for for next year. Yeah, obviously there. This is the um, this is like the point one of which every year, nothing less. Obviously, um, we know what it's going to take to get here. So if everybody comes back. It's gonna be a lot of senior, like a lot of senior, but leadership, a lot of experience. So hopefully, we can uh, go all the way next year. Did you guys think that this year was gonna be this year, or was it kind of more maybe maybe you guys could be decent this year and then next year? I thought we can go even farther than this. Um, when I watched this play in the summer, and, like scrimmage and stuff like that, we just had we had every piece we need: open shooters, the inside guys, defensive players, and just we had all the pieces. We just we just showed it to them. What do you think was the difference today, John? What, what caused kind of the slurred in the first half with them or you? Um, just we weren't we weren't flying around out there. Um, rebounding, we got our rebound in the first half. They had like 15 points, off second chance uh, points, and we just we weren't playing. We weren't sticking to our formula that it takes to win. And Buddy Hill is just a great player. Nothing we can do about that. You yeah, haven't been through this in a long time. What's what's this feeling like with this group right now, knowing that it came so close to get to the final four? Um, I don't know how it's feeling right now. I'm more worried about Elgin than Dwayne right now. I'm never going to play with them again. What did you think of how Elgin kind of went out today? I mean, he had a killer game out there. Elgin, he did the best he could do to try to get us to uh, win. He just obviously it's a team sport, and not everybody brought it, brought it today, including me. So, I mean, he did his job. So, he, how she's having nothing to hang his head about. You mentioned Buddy. It's just was he at a point where it's almost unguardable at times? Yeah, like it's nothing you can do about him. Like Elgin, Tyler, everybody was just up close to him, but he gets it up so quick and he creates so much space so fast. There's nothing you can do. He's like a Kobe Bryant, like you can't stop that. Did he take him from further away than he thought he might? Sometimes, I mean, yeah, no, yeah. Like I think the one right before the half in the first half, he took it from like NBA range, and like we knew he had range, but like. You don't see that. We haven't been playing against like that, somebody like that this whole season, so you're not um, expecting it. I know you guys felt like and wanted this to be your time, but did it kind of feel like it was his time? You know, he's a senior and he's yeah. been trying for a long time to get yeah, here. Yeah, like uh, I think Spangler told me, I was talking to him at the end of the game, he was like, they've been together all four years. So they knew each other, everybody knew their role on the team. There were no, like, even out there, they weren't arguing with each other. They were always in the right spots. Just, they just they just connected. Do you guys look at that and say, hey, if we can keep this thing together for a couple of years, that could be us? Most definitely. Um, right now, this is this is the bar we just set. So hopefully, um, we can exceed it uh, next year. Nothing less. Thanks, man. Can you do that next year? Um, just do everything that we need. Um, be a better scorer on the post. Better defender. Um, Learn the game, obviously more, um, just uh, taking advice from Coach Alvin. You've obviously been a good rebounder, a good defender. Mm -hmm. His offense is around the basket. Just your right yeah, I'm just going to work on that and uh, become a better rebounder, get a little bigger, get stronger, and just, just do everything Alvin tells me to do. Was there a huge difference between the athleticism of their bigs compared to Duke in terms of their ability to fly to the basket and get yeah. offensive rebounds? Yeah, yeah. They're, they're obviously much deeper than Duke. And um, those two guys inside were just, they were hard to get rebounded against them. They're so big and they're just as athletic as us. So it was pretty tough. How frustrating was it to see a team that just seemingly couldn't miss? It's very frustrating. I mean, like, you're doing, like Elgin and Tyler had great defense against Buddy, but when you're playing against somebody like that, it's, it's like, you can't do nothing to Buddy. I just take it. Anything to take away from him?